have vibes welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is nelly we hope you stay we hope you subscribe and we hope you become a part of the family for all the returning subscribers thank you i see y'all so i'm gonna take you guys along with me it's samu's birthday celebration today his birthday was on tuesday um so everyone else is already at the water park at happy island um i decided to follow just slightly behind them um so i'm getting ready now i've bathed i'm just gonna slip on a dress and head out so what i need to do is i need to firstly i need to take that beach bag um and then i need to go to crazy store go fill up the balloons with helium and then go to Tanta's house go drop off the balloons there and then take her bank card yeah and then head down to the water park it's literally just down the road from Tanta's house so yeah i'm gonna take you guys along with me together with other things i do during the the week yeah it's gonna be a couple of days with me so yeah let's go guys To be honest, I would wear flops, but I'm gonna embarrass some too much in front of these friends. So let me look some sort of kind of decent. Um, I'm not gonna be swimming or anything of that sort. I'm literally going to go help God other parents kids because there's so many of them so this is my fit my hair is a mess my ends are all knotted but i don't have time to straighten it so yeah this is me is to find everyone where they're chilling it's quite warm today which is great because with the cold front and everything we were worried that the poor kids were gonna get cold um, we usually sit that side when we're here so I'm gonna go that side I don't think that they send me a location but location pins when you're walking <laughs> tricky so I'm gonna walk that way and then I'll call them um, but yeah I found them without even having to look too hard which is great Hello. 
I think I want it's the fact that I'm the one who's tossed to come look for the kids because it's lunchtime and I'm like I don't even know all of them because I literally just arrived. I know those that I know. What about the others? And then I asked to sub he's like not having it. He literally just told me how many kids there are and he walked away. Now I'm standing here with the hope that they're gonna appear from this lazy ride because apparently they were here. Oh my god, this is just an extreme sport. Oh, there's this bee. On this on. <laughs> Uh -uh. Yeah. I go to the establishment. <laughs> I give at the establishment. I give at the establishment. <laughs> <laughs> I once said, I never went back ever again. Just got back. We just um, quickly setting up the area just to sing for Rusamu. The kiddos are here playing soccer. There we are. Here's my little pumpkin. I love baby. I love baby. <laughs> now I'm going to love okay. Come, guys, let's sing. We're losing the sun. And that's what's up. Okay, fantastic. You are. There we go. I No burnt meat. Are you done? Are you done? Three, two, 
One, go. Ba 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 ba. Two side, two side, two side. Just before nine. <laughs> Five two. Oh, <laughs> Mau ma like you five two. <laughs> Nine o'clock. This is Anna. This is Anna. This is on Friday. Friday. This is Anna. Bye bye. Bye bye, you guys. Thank you so much. Oh, 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 um, today is Wednesday. It's about half past two. So I'm literally starting my day off quite late. I was lazing around watching um, Love is Blind. But I feel like I need to be productive. So what I'm going to do so that I don't feel more bad <laughs> is I'm just going to grab the laundry from the small bedroom. It's all washed. It just needs to be fold it properly so that it can get ironed uh so yeah i'm gonna fetch it from the other side fold the chair so that maybe if i still have the energy in me clear out that room pack it put in bedding a uh, fresh bedding because it's also washed and just make that room presentable i've thrown everything literally on the bed I've been so lazy. It's become like a storeroom of some person who seems like is a hoarder. <sighs> yeah. Um. My plan was to go to the mall so that I can I, I could go collect my bank card. Um. Yeah. Bank card again. The previous one was blocked, and they couldn't unblock it. I don't know if it was the chip or what. So they ordered a new bank card for me. So, but I'm going to go get that probably tomorrow, if not Friday. Uh, but also I'm taking the car in for service on Friday. So I might have to Uber. I can't go tomorrow with this car because it has a slow puncture or something like that. I don't have the energy for it to be honest with you so yeah i'm gonna let chevy deal with it and then once everything is fine he will tell me that the cars are fine and then i'll get my shit together but let's get into it <laughs> Um, I've rolled up the towels. I'm gonna put them in the cupboard. Um, yes, I rolled up my towels. It's just something I'm so particular with. I don't fold them. I feel like it's neater and makes more space. So I'm left with my gym clothes pile that I need to fold. Um, I threw this bag on the floor because I don't know why. This is not clean. Shove it through it on the bed uh um yeah so this pile oh it's gonna storm this pile needs to be hung up all of this needs to be okay until here needs to be hung up that i need to just hoid in the cupboard with the winter clothes but yeah let's focus on this <laughs> Ok, 
okay so i just wanted to show you guys the rolling situation of my towel section so because the storage space and like compartment is so small i rolled them so that i can stack a whole lot of shit so there's throws there's towels literally starting from here stacked all the way so yeah this works for me because of my space and then i've got my bedding section and my pinifa army netball bibs used to play netball indoor my camera and then we've got all my curtains more camera stuff and straighteners so yeah that's what's happening here and then we've got blankies bags you name it okay guys so i'm a little embarrassed right so um i usually pack according to the color scheme so dark clothes on one pile this is just my tops right and then here this is my gym section it's a mess so i just figured let me just take all of this out pack it and then um put in all my gym clothes packed properly like how it used to be so i'll see you guys once i start packing everything in guys my friend once gave me this it's weird now focus focus yeah there. um this cycling one piece um when i thought i was gonna be a cyclist and then my one friend got me this of which i used to wear at netball at least i wore this also like the best like guys this as well you see this my goal is to lose weight so that i can fit into this bad boy because what i have never worn it not even once because it's small and then got this as well guys i'm sure this can fit my nephew i'm gonna give it to my nephew because what the hell like proper proper shit that costs like thousands of rands what's this oh it's a biker short an actual biker short not from h&m that i bought at where's this place decathlon wore it twice it's too small anyway that's my two cents let me get started okay guys there we have it so right at the back are my winter pajamas and then we've got my cycling clothes as well as my dust um i forgot what you call it dust something uh that i usually wear on my head when i'm having a bad head day these are all my tops so it's long sleeves then it's all the sh short sleeves and then it's all my tights and then all my bras then my sweat bands sweat wristbands um i didn't get here which is all my um underwear as well as my bottles like all my gyms oh wait something i'm looking for here that i can't find but anyway my bags my small bags um yeah i'll get to that probably tomorrow and then i'll also get to this portion tomorrow it's quite late and i want to start cooking now so but i did this part love bags so to be honest with y'all i'm really really lazy to do everything i wanted to do also it's just so late now that's why i hate starting things late i prefer to wake up early and then get my day started i'm also a bit hungry so i'm gonna dish up yesterday's food and then watch maybe two episodes of uh love is blind and then start cooking dinner so i'll see you guys properly tomorrow when i am super productive <laughs> i feel so useless but i tried i'll see you guys tomorrow bye hey my loves welcome back to my channel it's literally the next 
day um i said i was gonna have an early start to my day the next day i said all of this yesterday it was a complete lie it's around past 12 I'm just feeling so icky i don't know what's going on i don't know if i'm pmsing or i'm just anxious or i'm hungry i don't know what it is i even have a protein bar just to like i don't know take the hunger away i guess because i didn't have breakfast i tend to skip breakfast lately and then i eat after 12 but i don't think that's working out for me so i'm going to change it because also i do think it does contribute to my mood and ha i had completely forgotten that i had these in the cupboard which i could literally could have been taking every time before i go to the gym but anyway <laughs> It's a story for another day. So we're going to do the two shelves that I left out yesterday. And then we're going to do the small bedroom. Also, lately I tend to procrastinate a lot. So I'm trying to get rid of that like thing in my life. Because it tends to bother me over time. So I'm going to actually do everything I had appointed myself to do today just so that i don't know i feel better or maybe it's because i'm doing october and i just want to savannah so bad i don't know but like i'm going through something i don't know what it is but there's something that i'm going through right now but it's okay um let's get going with today's plans <laughs> Here's the one section. I've already shown you this. Then you've got the underwear section. Um, it's like organized mess. I feel the other underwears are still in the washing machine, like my bras and stuff. Then I I cleared out a whole lot of crap that was here. Let me just zoom out. Um, okay, it doesn't want to. A whole lot of crap that was here. Um, I tend to like keeping my earrings like this because these are earrings I wear like every day. So if I put them in my jewelry box in there, I need to literally search through um, studs that I want to put on, which is oopsie time consuming. So I leave them out like this, and it's just easier for me to find them because they're sitting literally in pairs so yeah i threw away most of my perfume boxes and just emptied them out it's just like just the perfume bottles sitting as is most of my perfumes are almost finished jesus then it's deodorant serums yeah there you have it um and then we've got this section that I need to still sort out, but we'll do that some other time. Okay, so this is my 
H&M tile that I'm going to take through tomorrow because they have that whole recycling thing of all clothes, right? So I'm going to take it through tomorrow. And then I've got another pile where I'm going to give away those clothes. I'm so sad. There's like three jeans that I wore like twice. And then I gained weight from Levi. It's Zara dresses, but it's fine. Maybe it's time for a whole new wardrobe. I feel like this top also needs to go. I just wore it because I saw it and I was like, shit, I haven't worn this in a long time. But yeah, it has like fish moth bites from back in the day. Anyway. Okay, here's the before of this room. <laughs> Guys, I promise y'all, it looks so much better. I can't believe this is me. But yeah, um, like I said, I had washed the bedding, which is here. Um, those are the clothes I need to take in that room where my other jerseys are. And then I need to remove my stock. And so this coffee table um um tv stand is our old tv stand before we changed uh to the one we currently have i use it as my um stock compartment because it obviously it's there's fragrances there's chemicals so i tr just try to keep it away from us um so that we're just not inhaling the fumes this is the sample paper bag more stock more stock so i'm just gonna organize this this and put it in here and then i'm gonna try and make space for this to go just around the bed um so shabby wanted to take this away and like give it away so i was like no wait um i don't have space to put away my fragrances and stuff so hence why it's here yes it does take up space but also where else will my products go if i don't put it in there i'm still trying to figure that part out but let me let me organize and then um i'm probably gonna take a break i did order food i'm hungry i haven't had lunch i actually haven't had a proper meal since the I haven't had a meal actually today and it's half past two i just had that protein bar so i'm going to take a break in a few when the food arrives and then continue afterwards i want to make candles today i really do because i postponed it to today but yeah let's see how far i get okay so guys this is where we're at it's so weird because the room suddenly feels so much bigger. I really need to get a, he a headboard for this bedroom. So I just left the pillows like this because uh, my aunt gave me this. And I really want to get rid of it. But because I feel like it really works with... Okay, maybe it's better like that. It really works with the bedding. Of which I got at Woolies. It's this. I think it falls under the recyclable material. Recycled material. It's like. It's so soft. But. I hate it because literally. You do this. And it wrinkles. But anyway. This corner will be sorted out. And will look better. When I. Get this pile sorted out which it will be over the weekend these are my soft lights yeah so i need to look for space for these hats i need to look for space for these hats now the next mission is sorting out um everything that's in there there's nothing that needs to be thrown out that i know for sure it's just me repacking properly so that these can be in there and then i can get rid of these boxes i don't know what i'm going to do with this 
But yeah, we're slowly getting there. So here I did Mademoiselle, same as here, and then here I did Bitch Food and Bergamont, and then so there you have it my loves, um, I'm gonna close off today's vlog here. I'm gonna start cooking now, I'm gonna clear up and then start cooking dinner and then tomorrow yeah i'll take you guys along with me tomorrow morning my loves um today is friday um it's about 22 7. i'm quickly just making coffee and then i'm gonna leave the house at around 10 to 7. my class starts at 7. Even if I can leave the house at 5 to 7, I'll still make it because I'm going to the gym up the road. But yeah, I thought let me start the vlog now, now that I'm getting my day like started. I just finished my session. I'm headed home now. Got myself a smoothie. Yeah, let's go. Hello, so I'm done bathing. I'm gonna put sunscreen onto it because I'm gonna leave the house. Usually, I think in my last video, you didn't see me putting sunscreen on. That's because I knew I was gonna be in the house the whole entire time. Of which is something that happens quite often. I am really a homebody. Like today was the first time I drove out the complex. Um, since Monday and today is Friday <laughs> so yeah was it Monday? where did I go on Monday? but I feel like I did drive out on Monday or was it Sunday? it was Sunday I lost left the house on Sunday I've been indoors the entire week but today because i need to take the car in like i said and then i need to go to the bank i'll be using an uber whilst the car is being serviced um it's literally like all eight minutes apart so my uber won't be bad I'm not gonna walk on any other day I would attempt to walk I'm not gonna do that because it is hot today there is a heat wave that was announced through the weather service so I'm not gonna do that I'm actually gonna Uber I'm not gonna also take the clothes to H&M today because what if they reject them and then they say no we're done with that and then I have to walk around with a garbage black garbage bag 
the whole time at the mall. Can't even take it to the car because I won't have a car. So rather not, I actually thought about it. I was like, nah. So it's just gonna be F and B, Epsa, and then I'm done. Okay, so I just dropped off the car. Just waiting for a driver to come and drop me off at the mall. So yeah, um, just at the lounge area. Guys, so I'm thinking whilst I wait, I wash my hair so that later on my neighbor can braid me. She's, we'll try. Actually, we're gonna try it out to see if she can manage. I think she's still learning. She's still learning. I'm just gonna do con rows. Rows. So I have this cup <laughs> that, I, that stays here in this vanity cupboard that I use for when I wash my hair at home. So I'm going to use that. I need to fetch the, the thingy, the um, shampoo and conditioner. Because I don't want us to start braiding and then they call me to tell me that the car is ready to be collected. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do quickly. <laughs>
Then you connect the extension cord and then you've done it this. This is the part I dread the most. That's why I always go to the salon. I really hate drying my hair. I really hate hair drying my hair because it takes me crazy. But today, it's not too thick. It's still kind of relaxed, so... But yeah, if I had to straighten it, it will be back to a sleek, sleek, sleek bob. But we don't want that because I don't want the the braids to come loose because of my ends. Um, yeah, but we'll see. I hope this works out for her. Oh, my head feels so fresh. God, this is what I needed. Guys, there's nothing greater like driving a car that's just been serviced. It literally always feels brand new. Like, I feel like I just fished it and celebrating like those ladies who were like celebrating after fetching their new car. Oh, that was so cute. But yeah. This person learning how to drive with that BM. Damn. So yeah, um, it feels so great. And the salesperson, not salesperson, but the I don't know what you call them, the assistant. Was so great. Oh, he was so great. This car really, really needed to be serviced. We like really really stretched it. Um it needs to go in very soon again because of the major service this was just a minor service but yeah i'm so happy big up to um toyota clear water hey my loves so i just got to clear water also afternoon it's a new day i just got to clear water more um, I literally was here to come do a new card because I failed the last time, the last time I spoke. Um, but I'm sorted with that part. And then I drove around to the H&M section just to ask them if they still do the whole recycling thing. Don't want to walk around with this big plastic bag at the mall. And then I have to walk back um, just in case they didn't, they weren't doing it anymore. But they said they still do take um, old clothes, so. She has the plastic bag. Um, I'm about to go take it in now. Um, yeah, let's see how many discount cards they give me because they're stingy lately. So I got four vouchers for um, the big plastic that I've got that I had. Yeah, I think I can go home now. Guys, here I am continuing with my life, forgetting that I left y'all hanging during the course of the day. Today I had hands. Um, I was so demotivated, I couldn't even continue vlogging. Um, everything was just not going accordingly. Um, everything was just not go going accordingly, so I thought, you know what, let me not bring that energy into into the vlog um but anyways let's just move on because i yeah i just washed my face and then i remembered as i was about to put my serum i remembered that i bought these guys my fingers yo my my nails 
I bought these a while ago. This face fruit salad. Um, I literally used one and I forgot about it. I actually need to check the expiration date because what the hell? Um, I don't know if I showed you the nourishing, but ooh, there you go. And then, shoot, there's still a lot. Um, I'm balancing. I think there was six in total. Yeah. Um, I used one. Um, three. No, that means there was seven in total because I used one. Yeah, seven piece fruit salad thingy that I ordered from Superbalist. Just need to check when it expires because I used this a while ago. Doesn't say. Uh, that's before, nothing. Okay, anyway. So I just washed my face, like I said. So I'm just gonna open one. I thought let me let me just do this with y'all um as i officially close off the vlog so i'm going to use the firming it says leave on for 15 clean and apply toner apply the mask on your face leave for 15 to 20 minutes take it off gently massage the remaining essence uh and allow it to absorb into skin okay cool Guys, Koreans and beauty stuff. So, okay. Oh, it looks, it looks like you know what. <laughs> uh, see what I'm saying? <laughs> oh my God. This is taking me forever. Ooh, I hope it's not cold because the last one I used yo I think that's what made me <laughs> not to use it ever again well to take a while to use it the next time around ah, it's cold My sister, my elder sister, <laughs> always says there's like something wrong with me because I buy all these things but never use them. Like literally never use them. So I had this serum um, from Yardley, no, from L'Oreal um, that I purchased through a friend uh, with that whole stuff this kind of thing is so i bought two at like a like dirty cheap amount um and then i just always had it so i also used the serum like maybe twice three times um and stopped and then obviously still had the open one um the closed one so I told her about it. I'm like, hey, hey, actually, I have a serum because we we're talking about how we're trying to just improve our skincare routine and whatnot. And she was like, she spoke about a serum and I was like, actually, I have one. I have two, actually. And I showed her. I'm like, I don't really know how it works. Blah, blah, blah. Um, then I showed her. She was like, are you fucking insane? Do you know how much this thing costs? Um, at the shops, blah, blah, blah. So I gave her one. She was the happiest girl, let me tell you. Uh, okay, I'm going to leave this on for like 20 minutes. I'm going to watch a vlog whilst we wait for this thing to penetrate the skin. Um, But yeah, there we are. <laughs> 
um thank you so much for watching guys and thank you for making it this far into the video please like share comment subscribe um yeah let's grow this channel uh i don't know pay uh put white hearts on the on in the comment section to show that you actually made it this far into the video I love you guys. Till the next time. Bye.